Good day, people. Crazy Rebecca dances with pitbulls here. How are you on this rainy, rainy Saturday morning? I have a party to go to, and I'm going to have to go in the rain. <laughs> oh, well. I have here the Journal of the Darkest Blue, and sometime, I think it was not yesterday, but the day before, I had this genius idea of using lyrics in a couple of my spreads, and I did one yesterday in this book. I did Kryptonite and featuring me as Superman. Uh, this music was a big part of my life for many years. This came, came from my, my music book. I have like four of them. Four books, like a country, a classic, a rock, a thing, and a one I used to try to do, but I never quite mastered them. So, yeah, these are from that. I have one for this book. Now, you've probably heard me say several times, it's calm under the waves in the blue of my oblivion. That is from a song called Sullen Girl by Fiona Apple. And Miss Barb, that was her favorite song for a long time. She even went by that nickname. So I got so excited, I cut these out. Not on camera. Because I was like, oh, I want to do this, I want to do this. And, Barb, listen to me. Are you listening? These are my original Yahoo lyrics. I never really mastered this song, but I believe I sang it, part of it, a cappella for you once. Maybe not, I don't know. But, yes, these are years old from my music book, from my original Yahoo music book. That's how much I love you. Okay, I'm going to put it here, and first I'm going to stamp hopefully what look like bubbles. <laughs> random, random bubbles. They might show, they might not show. Right. Then I'm going to ink. Is it all going to fit on there? I need to trim. I need scissors. Ugh. You ever noticed your scissors can disappear in the blink of an eye? Because I carry them from this room to that room. And then I don't know where I put them. And... Okay, I was going to ink first, but I think the first step is making sure it all fits. Maybe this is going to be need to be on two pages, like tonight was, but I thought 
it was small enough we could cram it just cram it you know the worst thing about this song there's not enough cowbell Barb is an excellent cowbell player haha -ha. Now, if she wants to play, she has the lyrics and the chords. Okay. Do this quick. Quickish. Taking my Star Wars trivia game to the party. There's a, at least two couples there that I've tried to get up to my house to play. Scheduling problems prevent us. So I thought, well, I'll take it. If they're there, game on. Oh, and so here's what uh, one of one of the guys said when I when I told him last time, "Hey, I won it, tri Star Wars Trivial Pursuit." He's like, "So you invite people to your house to play games and then you beat them?" Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna back off just because you're my guest. <laughs> it was a miracle. I was up against the Star Wars expert. I was glad I won. I was proud. I beat the king. I beat the champ. All right. I know there's one more. <laughs> Did I drop it? No. Is this it? No. Okay, you guys saw this. What happened? It's the part about the pearl. <laughs> oh, for Pete's sake. Selling girl. I didn't throw it away, did I? I'm going to have to stop this video. And watch it and see what happened. Uh, yeah, under the table. Okay. Let's glue these babies down before they take off on me again. need something for here. I wish I had a mermaid picture. If, if I do have one, I don't know where it is. Okay, 
what can I put there? Uh, I'd cut some butterflies out, but it doesn't really go. Why does it have to go? I'll be right back. Nothing in this world has to make sense, right? Or it does. Nothing in this world makes sense. Because that's why, just because all right, I'm gonna call it good. it a lot. It means a lot to me. Okay. This concludes the working in the Journal of the Darkest Blue. Should I call this one? I don't know. It's only one page. It's only one. Uh, I'm going to think about it. This may or may not be a thing. So please subscribe if you haven't already done so and give me a like and a comment and share if you are so inclined and I'll see you next time.